What's up everyone, Bizas here and welcome to my channel which is all about music production, sound design, Ableton Live and all things related. Isoto, they are the authors of really cool plugins like Ozone, the mastering plugin, Nectar, Neutron and many other. Now, Isotope is now a part of Native Instruments and Native Instruments recently released a complete start package, which is a package of quite a few nice instruments and quite a few nice effects that you can download for free and use them in your music production studio, in your DAW, whatever DAW would that be. And one interesting thing, they've included Ozone 11 EQ. And we're gonna try to find it today, install it and see if it's even working. Okay, let's figure out how to get it. Come on. Okay, so we are on the Native Insurance website. Let's click here. Okay, sorry, let's click on the products. Let's try to find the free one, which is the tab here. And uh, we have the Ozone 11 EQ. Okay, let's click on that. We have a little description. Obviously it says it's free, free mastering EQ. Pretty nice to have mastering EQ. That is actually really good. And let's try to download it. Free download here. Okay, we have to have an account on the native instruments. If you have one, that's perfect. If you don't have one, just simply create one. After creating the account, you will need the native access app, which is basically a plugin downloader app, an app that makes sure that all your plugins are up to date. You basically have to have it if you want to install anything. But the good thing is that along with the Ozone 11 EQ, you will get quite a lot of instruments and effects that I've mentioned about. They are all for free and they all will be in the native access app. So okay, just click on get free software. And if you want to add Ozone EQ 11 to your account, click get Ozone 11 EQ. Now, if you have the native access app, perfect. If not, you have the links to download it. Everything is very simple. Once you install it, it looks like this. Okay, we are in the new native access app and we have Ozone 11 equalizer and we can just simply install it by clicking this button here. Perfect. And it's installing now. Okay, so now let's try to find it inside our DAW. So if we have the DAW open already, we want to rescan the plugin. So let's go to the live settings or preferences in Windows. And then we go to plugins and press rescan. It's going to scan the new plugins and it's going to list them here in the sidebar. I think you've already found it. So let's go to plugins, BAC3. And let's try to find uh, isotope. Ozone 11 equalizer. There it is. Okay, we can slap it on the master channel here. And there it is. Okay, let's try to play some music to it and let's see how it works. Okay, so we have one of the songs that I'm actually working on here and let's play some music to it and see how it works. Okay, so let's uh, slap the Ozone 11 equalizer just here and let's see how it works. Let's try to boost something in the middle. Oh, I like this frequency here. Maybe the amount will be critical. Let's cut some of the lows. What like resonant. That's crazy. Okay. That's okay. Does it have a mid-side mode? Yes, it does have a mid-side mode. Let's boost the highs on the side. Let's go for like a high shell. Very good. What if you want to cut a particular frequency? Oh yes, that's what I'm looking for. Let's solo it. Okay, perfect. Perfect, very good. Works very fine. I like it, I love it. I will be using it for sure. Okay, so we basically get really good EQ for your mastering, but the whole purpose of this video was to show how to install it and how to find it, and there we actually did it perfectly. Okay, so installing this e Ozone 11 EQ was actually very simple. You just need to follow some of the steps, register your account, click on some buttons, and make sure you have the newest Native Access 2 app installed, the one that's kind of more black mode, not the white one. Okay, so don't forget to subscribe to the channel or hit the like button, that helps a lot. And uh, that's it in this little short video. Thanks so much for watching and see you guys in the next video. Cheers!